Before stay-at-home orders related to the COVID-19 pandemic were announced, parts of Pennsylvania were already under quarantine, thanks to a small invasive species that could have a huge impact on the state's economy. The spotted lanternfly was first discovered six years ago in Berks County. It then began to spread to other parts of the Commonwealth. The original area of concern was in southeastern Pennsylvania, but earlier this year, 12 new counties were added to the state-imposed quarantine to slow the spread of this invasive species. The additions came as areas of infestation were found within these counties. The problem with the spotted lanternfly is that it thrives on the sap of over 70 different plant species, including grapevines, fruit trees, and some hardwood species, many of which play an important role in Pennsylvania's agricultural economy. A study conducted by economists at Penn State revealed if not contained, the spotted lanternfly could cost the Commonwealth $324 million annually. While the flies are not present this time of year, their egg masses are. Each egg mass contains 30 to 50 eggs and resembles splattered mud. They can be found on hard surfaces such as trees, stones, and patio furniture. If you find one, use a putty knife or plastic card and scrape the mass into a plastic bag filled with rubbing alcohol or hand sanitizer. Tie the bag and then throw it into the trash. Don't just scrape the mass onto the ground as some may survive. In a few weeks, the hatch of egg masses will begin and early stage nymphs will appear. These hatchlings are only a few millimeters in length and can be identified by their black bodies and legs, which are covered in white spots. They can be found feeding on areas of new growth on plants and get there by climbing tree trunks. Residents can take advantage of this behavior by putting sticky tape, such as flypaper, around tree trunks to trap the nymphs. Place a three inch band four feet up from the ground and overlap the ends. It's important to then put chicken wire or other fencing around and above the area to prevent songbirds, butterflies, and other important creatures from being trapped. Once the nymphs get stuck on the band, you can take it off the tree and throw it in the trash. It's important to know that you should alert the Pennsylvania Department of Agriculture if you spot egg masses or nymphs on your property. Just go to their website for information on reporting. Businesses that travel outside of quarantine counties may need to take extra precautions when doing so. Residents living in quarantine areas who aren't traveling for business are asked to check and remove evidence of the pest from any outdoor equipment such as grills and lawnmowers and from their vehicles before they hit the road. Doing so can help stop the spread of this insect and keep Pennsylvania's economy healthy. To find out more about how you can help, go to extension.psu.edu slash spotted lanternfly. For Weather World, I'm Marissa Ferger.